Oh my bad. <laughs> oh my bad. <laughs> Yo, Alex 19, stay fucking free, pussy. Yeah, Anyways, we're, we're, talk, we're talking about like, yeah, Alex 19, like he had to go to the hospital, and then he's just like, that guy fucking Dude, someone's, sucks. someone's gonna, <laughs> someone's gonna take this clip out of context. They're gonna be like, why are these bigger people guys talking about SoCal? Like, just stay free. Stay free. Nah, but I have to gas them. I'm believing it's out of context, so they feel bad. Nothing but respect for Alex Nike. Absolutely. Nah. He's a pillar that, of that, that guy's funny as so. hell. Nothing but respect. That guy would beat me up. You know, I yeah. could say fucking Alex 19, but one, he, uh, I think he'd probably still beat me because he's pretty good. I remember playing him once at uh, Super Smash Sundays, and um, I got dusted. That's why I was like learning melee. But he would also beat me IRL. You know, so yeah. <laughs> no beef, Alex 19. It's, yeah. all, it's all love. No lie, I think Alex 19, if he really wanted to, he could, he could kill me with one punch. <laughs> Anyways, game one, we got Goose up against Aaron. Uh, Goose taking the first stock. I think the same thing's gonna apply to this matchup, right? Um, Goose just needs to control the tempo, right? When Goose is playing at his tempo, at his pace, he does really good. Um, Aaron, however, might be a little shaky from last game. Uh, definitely, Aaron is known to be a hater. I love him. But uh, I think he'll clean it up, be fine. Like you were talking about like, the Foxy, how edge guarding is important. I think in this matchup, it's even more important. Just letting Fox live his Falcon, when you don't have to protect off of your grab, it's so bad. I feel like you really have to kill Fox when you get the chance to spell Falcon. He's playing pretty well. Playing really patient. Playing really well. Getting a lot of value off of AC bears and stuff and keeping Aaron out from trying to get in. So. Aaron has to mix up his approaches because it looks like we should just be able to wall him out pretty well. Wait, Boost kind of got PP lasers. He got the PPMD lasers. He's shooting them hella low. What the hell? Dude, I can't fire lasers. Yeah, I, I, don't, I don't know how you guys do it. I mean, obviously, I'm not a Falco player, but when I play for fun, I try really hard to shoot low lays. Shit's impossible. I don't know how you do it. That was shooting a couple low lays too. I was like, what the fuck? Does everyone just have low lays except me? Then again, you guys are the Falco players. I am just the resident puff player. So. That was very scary. He yeah, definitely. Anytime he def any yeah, anytime ledge. Fox near ledge, I'm like, dude, Falco can die. Like, he's playing uh, really well. I guess you just let Gerard win for the plot. Wants to make it more suspenseful for later. Whatever, Gerard. Thank you for bringing this. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> Here's his fucking. He's starting to feel himself. He's trying to. He's trying to farm another. He's in the like. Trying to farm another loud dust. Yeah, he's definitely in my power. Oh, that was a scary nair. The Aaron did not try to shield and I get a punch off this. Could be a good. Should be the game right here. Can I just knock you out? Nice I'm not gonna lie, if Goose missed the edge guard, I would be scared. Just because Fox is yeah. on 110. Yeah. All of a sudden, it's hard to kill him. I think Aaron goes FOD. That looked like his comfort pick last time. I don't know if he's gonna go something else based off uh, playing against Goose, but Aaron likes FOD a lot. He went it a lot on Sheik, too. Except against me, of course, I'm a puff player. <laughs> yeah, no, no, that's, yeah, I gotta get pumped here, but I'm fucking being a dickhead. <laughs> Dude, I've been, I used to hate FOD, and I still do, but I've been ready to like it more. In some matchups, I still don't like it against Fox. I, I don't like it against Spacey, but I've learned I like it. FOD. I mean, as floaty players, like, we probably like FOD because we like, live longer, but sometimes those platforms against fastballers just get you in such like, weird scenarios, right? Because like, Spacey's can do like double drill, right? They have the platform a specific height, they can just do drill, fall down, drill. Like, it's really good on Falco to do that. Um, he's taking a really fast talk. Um, I wonder what Aaron's, like, uh, reasoning is for coming to the ocean. I feel like the space would probably serve him well. Maybe he just felt like he was getting walled out by Goose, but... I also feel like Goose is good on small stages. I was gonna say, if you're getting walled out when you're on a bigger stage, you have, like, more space to move around like that, you know what I'm saying? I don't know, maybe he just wants to try by checking around. Yeah, but Falco's not fast, right? Like, yeah. When I say you want more space, like, so you have, like, longer dash ins, right, to mix up your timing to, like, get in and stuff. Well, on a short stage, right, it's like, well, I just have to be, I have to stuff this person with, like, a shine, right, or, like, a 
find like a crash cancel up punch or something. I keep on hitting a lot of those backers, like the front backers. Oh, I did. Oh, no one. <laughs> Really weird skirmish, but crush cancel thing at 80. That's kind of wild. Crush cancel is so broken. I just realized. Yeah, I feel like I don't crush cancel ever. I feel like my defense is so bad. I should just start. How do you guys? You guys like religiously crush cancel like automatically with like your C stick, right? That's how a lot of people crush cancel. They hold like C stick down when they're about to get hit or something. Yeah. I've just learned when you play, you just have to always be able to go. At low percents, like literally when you're below 50, you just hold down all the time. So, so Aaron is really good at using crouch cancel. It is one of his strong suits. I think everybody in the scene knows that. But uh, against Falco, it's like really tough, right? Falco's uh, probably like the one character you can't crouch cancel against, right? You get a fat dare. You're just kind of standing there. Yeah. I mean, Falco and Fox, both of them, like if you get the shot in this box. Yeah, you can't crouch cancel a uh, drill right because it's multi hit. So. Yeah. Well, you, you can't crouch cancel. You can ASDI it until I get behind yeah, you, right? Yeah, you can ASDI out of this thing. But you can't crouch cancel if it's a spike, too. It's just a really weak spike. Alright, last stock. Despite it being last stock, I still think Goose is like pretty in control. You can see like he's just in control of his face really well. Yeah, calling out, he's calling when Aaron's falling through platforms, lasering him, stopping him from the Oh, like, wait! Fox no. is broken. Yeah. Oh, no! Let's go! Oh. Well played by Aaron though, take advantage of the situation. I mean, that was just a good shine, dude. Big ass hitbox. Need to use out the stage. Ah, uh, yeah, I mean, he, play, it's like he, he plays really well. I just feel like. Oh, let's oh, go. Goose with the no. six zero to death. <laughs> <laughs> Insane zero to death. That, that was a cerebral zero to death. Uh, Aaron just keep a post. You can bring it back with quick stops. So you shouldn't worry too much. But uh, Goose's punish is starting to really like warm up. Uh, and the set against Gerard. He's controlling the pace, but he's gonna get as many punishes. Gerard being a local fast, but just takes a million percent off of one hit. But uh, Goose is starting to cook. Goose is no, no way around it. Goose is. Huh? The one last game? This one last game. Dude, Goose is moving right now. Uh, the SD is very unfortunate, but I think even without the SD, Goose looks like. Dude, you should go FOD all the time. I mean, the, Goose you know, is that Goose looks really good on FOD. You know, you know, you know he calls this Fountain, fountain of Geese, right? Uh, honestly, it is. He can have it. It's not my stage anymore, it's Goose. Dude, I only like the stage as Marth. I only like the stage versus Puff and Cheek. You like coming here against Puff on Marth? I like it more than Battlefield. Interesting. Oh, the dash dance? Oh, I did. He's calling him out. Dude, what is happening? Oh, God. I feel like when you get dash dance on by a Falco, it feels so much worse than every other character. It's so short. Like, it's not that much bigger than Sheik's. No, you can't. The thing about Fox, he could always bring it back. He could just get one shine. And somehow... Aaron could get one good grab here, and he can definitely get a quick zero death. Or he can just get a cheesy kill. Right? He can get like an up throw shine or a back throw turn. But uh, I just don't think it's going to happen. It's looking really tough for Aaron. Um, the SD definitely uh, is unfortunate, but uh, I think without that SD, Goose is just controlling the tempo of the match so well. Goose's lasers are like really good in this match. He's not like constantly, like he's not shooting him, there's like, he's not shooting him off cooldown. Like he's definitely mixing up his timings, he's calling out when like Aaron's about to like approach him. Or if he falls through a platform, he's trapping him under the platform so he can't move anywhere. And he's already close to ledge, so it's like he has to approach him or, you know, he backs up to ledge right now, now he has center stage, right? Um, but this is what I expected. I think Aaron to go to that bigger stage. Uh, I'm assuming he didn't want to go FD because uh, Goose is just lasering really well. 
I'm assuming the platform here is gonna help him go off plus his face, but um I don't know man, Goose is I feel like Goose is a bit This is like I feel like this is the best I've seen him before. Goose is a land monster. <laughs> Goose yeah, Goose is a definition of see me on land. Yeah, he does not move like this on that way. Uh, he, dude, his laser is still in that place. Oh, the other dude, like his box is broken. That's fine though, just go check it out. Aaron is missing his tech kit though. A little uncharacteristic. Aaron does pretty well with the tech I mean, he's a cheap player. Was a cheap player. Put respect on the Oh, he was looking for it. Oh, he's calling him out, dude. Like, is hit. He, I feel like he's hit a lot of effort. That's a lot of, he's, he's getting a lot of call outs for sure. I don't know. Oh. Uh, dude, two stops. Just come like that. People talk, people talk about like Fox getting cheese, like with Fox down the road, and, like down the road and stuff. But I feel like Fox is low key like a cheese monster. Wow. Alright, well, Aaron on his last spot potentially for the set. Taking a quick breather to get composure, see if he can bring it back. It just looks like Goose is have uh, Goose is doing really well, uh like not like getting aggravated and like chasing Fox, right? Aaron's really good at like uh like making you approach him and then like he just does all his like full hop shenanigans. And Goose just isn't dealing with it. Like he's hitting him with like a full hop there, running away till he pretty much get a hard knockdown, right? Which is like really good. A lot of Falcons will overextend, right? Like they'll get a high dare, they'll try and continue off of it, right? Then you just end up like in a bad position. But Goose is just playing, you know, not hit and run, he's just punishing the full hops and pretty much building up the percent to where he can't crouch against them anymore. He's doing a really good job about it. Or just like sneaking in a shine under the platform. Um, that's something Goose is really good at. Goose is really good at like um, hunting for shines. Uh, just like hitting a quick short hop that and that wave on and just like leading this up by But uh, Aaron is bringing it back to the stream. Looks like he uh, might have gone something out. That's crazy though, because this game is like. He was kind of SD twice because he got hit by the Firefox and died on uh, his first stock. Stock to stock. Stock to stock. Even with those two like, kind of misplays by him, it still was really close. It was very close, but. I think Goose keeps composure, he'll do well. Aaron did bring him back to however. Is this the first game five to try? Yeah. Yeah, this is I think this is the first game five, right? Yeah. <laughs> Andrew, first game five! Switch the layout! Silver screen? I think they're saving it for bracket though. There you go. Uh, I wasn't holding her, I was trying to push her off. Oh, were you? Yeah. Oh, I couldn't tell. She, she was holding on. <laughs> yeah, I was like moving her forward. Alright, let's see. Game five. Let's see who's who has the clutch. Battlefield? What is the second one? What did they start on? No, I think they start. Did they start on Pokemon? Oh, good. Oh, I'm lucky for Aaron. Ah, clean up the stock, anyways. That was a really good, though. Uh, going out really far to uh, clean up the stock. Good luck, bro. Uh, we should have this stock, though. Some lasers. Ah. He's gotta clean the stock up fast or something, get really bad. Aaron is starting to get a little more. Oh, good. nice shine bear, wow. That was fast. That was really good. Uh, it looks like Aaron is getting a little more comfortable in the spacing, starting to mix up his full hop timings. Not a full hop is super 
Yeah, it's, it's, it's really strong for sure. Um, he's mixing up his timings, starting to make a do set the approach a little more. Yeah, Aaron's not looking to not, not looking to really like chase him down anymore. Looks like he's adjusting his play style to it pretty much. Looking for a lot of stray hits. Downside of Falco doing it, Chris on the Falco. No. They're just good for both of them. Remember, we're just stuck on. So, I mean, it's fine. Just playing this stuff. Aaron is uh, not getting a lot of his grab. So I can't tell if it's shitters or what it is, but. Uh... Oh, nice reversal from there from Goose. Oh, no double jump. Oh, nice ledge dash, but Aaron calling out. Facing for a block really. Ah. Ramen noodles, that's tough. Yeah, I mean, it looks like this is starting to struggle with the full hop. Uh, she probably mix up his up tilt timing and stuff like that more, but this is really hard to tell. You're playing a lot more patience, keeping him out. Getting a lot of value off the full hop, all two bears. Yeah, dropping some edge guards that he was throwing up for sure, but um, last stock, not undoable. Look, this would have to play very clean here. All it takes is a straight hit from Fox and uh, instantly in the ledge guard scenario. I'm also surprised he didn't up smash there. I think he's, yeah, it, it kills, right? I mean, it's Fox. He's looking for an open, though. Oh, okay. I think if he laser forward throws, he might be able to do something. Very scary high there. Yeah. He snows. Unlucky. Aaron bringing it.